Hi. Everybody's standing up. Uh oh, where's Willow? She's right there. Oh, there she is. Hendrix is here. So many more bags. Uh oh, I lost the mitt. Here, take the grain. He's a little bit chubby. I know, he is a chubby boy. Well, that's what you gotta do. You gotta find food. He wants food. I said, don't feed him a lot, but. We it's winter time. He needs a lot. And he goes hunting and he gets super fat. Good morning guys, welcome to family day. Family day without Sam. Because Sam, because Sam forgot to take the day off, apparently. Either that or he did not want to be a part of our family. No, just joking. He has to sign days off. Like he has to sign up for the day off kind of thing at his work and he forgot. So we run him ragged on our little farm. Anyway, welcome to today. Today family day and we are gonna go ride horses yeah you knew it right that's what we do um yeah there's a flood in the arena wonder who did that uh. oh, yeah so basically remember sam was like you you the arena hmm who did it today Sam <laughs> it's funny that how probably why he left. like it just happens you can't yeah, control it Dad, when we get up yeah what are you say, gonna say to him he flooded the arena yeah man and it's still pouring too yeah not much we can do but we could fill up that bucket <laughs> take it's so much water probably ran water all night good thing we're on a well <laughs> anyway welcome to today today uh, Gabby is at the house eating breakfast because she didn't we were ready to go and I'm like how much breakfast did you eat? And she's like none and I'm like we're going for riding lessons. You have to eat stay home. I just came back from the sewer <laughs> Yeah, the our arena is into a sewer now. I All right, let's throw hay guys, but they're just gonna have Let's to throw hay come on Yesterday we took our ponies for a ride, for a walk I mean. We took them for a big walk and Sky you could tell really enjoyed it. All of our ponies enjoyed it. And she's like, what are you saying? What are you talking about me? <laughs> and it, it was a really sad time for me. It was so sad because I really miss Stella. Sophie and I both really noticed the loss of Stella yesterday, huh? Yeah. And I don't know why, but when we got Sky, I kind of felt like she would kind of replace Stella, and she hasn't, she doesn't. She's nothing like Stella. She's aloof and unconnected and quiet and shy. We should nickname her Shy Sky. And she doesn't fulfill any of the needs in me that I wanted for like a heart horse, because she's not a heart horse. She, she likes salt like so. Yeah, do you think we should get rid of her? No. Well, she's not anything that we wanted, though. Still, doesn't mean she doesn't get to live here. Yeah, but she's not valuable to us because. Still. So you think we should keep her? Yeah. Yeah. I just wanted to say that, you she guys. She dumped her water. That's the whole thing. That's the thing. She's shy and aloof, and it's not her fault. We haven't really been able to do anything to make her feel at home yet because of the weather and because of our time constraints. But summer and spring are coming. And we'll have more time. And do you guys think we should get rid of her just because she's shy and aloof? Here, put her halter on. My guess is that you don't think we should. That we should give her a chance. We should spend more time. That her life is valuable. That's what I think you guys would say. And here's the thing. If you'd say that about a horse that nobody really connects with and that nobody really Love because you're shy. Don't you think that about yourself? Just because you're shy or quiet or aloof doesn't make you any less valuable, right? So, does it make you any less worthy? It makes me sad sometimes that people are so impatient that they don't give everyone a chance, that there's a time limit put on when you get to fit in. 
Right. Head out, Gracie girl, that way. There you go, sweetness. No way. Now, you, they all know. They're like, hmm. Job. She's a nasty little thing? Should we get rid of her because she's sassy? Should we get rid of Gabby because she's sassy? <laughs> she had to think about that one for a minute. You wanted to say yes? Yeah. <laughs> so if you do anything at all today for yourself, I think you should go out there and allow yourself to be whoever you are and allow yourself to have whatever experience you're having and know that it's okay and that you're okay and that you're still valuable and, you'll, and you're still worthy of love and affection and attention. I feel like with social media, people put so much pressure on how popular you are and how many followers you have and how many people love you. This guy's a boss in the field. But most of that's just a myth, you guys. It's just a myth. Nobody has 7,000 good friends. Right, Gracie? Your only job in this world is to go out there and find the people that are meant for you. And it's probably only a handful of people, right? Maybe 20 people in your whole lifetime. So if somebody doesn't appreciate you and doesn't love you and treats you badly, what should you do? Pick them out. Move on. See you later. Life is too short to waste time on people who are not meant for you. Does it mean there's something wrong with you if it's, they're not meant for you? No. No. Does it mean there's something wrong with them? No. Yeah, no, just kidding. <laughs> of course not, because they're still searching for people for them too. Anyway, this is it. This is our little mare herd that is needing some love and attention. So, Sophie, we need to do this. We need to like make Sky a part of our group. You want to do it? Okay. She's a little sassy to walk. Yeah, she, she tries. To bolt. She is a bit sassy, but here's the thing. I challenge you guys to go out there today. Find one person and try and do one that kind thing to make them feel like a part of your group. Hi. Hi. You flooded the arena. Did I? Yes. All night long. Oh my gosh. It's the a whole sewer. thing is a sewer. Okay. I didn't have it on that. Much. Oh, it's flying out. Well, they have enough water now. Yeah, if they get thirsty, they can just drink the ground. <laughs> No, Gracie's a princess. She could not touch any water. Yeah, Gracie did not touch the water. I, didn't, I only had it open to get. So is that you trying to say I can understand how it happens to anybody? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Oh, no. I told them last night. You did tell them last night? Well, I wasn't down there last night. But <laughs> when I came home from watching Gracie's lesson, we fed them, and I'm like, it's still frozen, but I didn't close it. Because Dad left it open. It's okay. Everybody makes mistakes. We still accept you and love you. Okay? All right. We're off to the barn. I don't understand why I didn't leave it overnight, though. Yeah, why would you leave it overnight? Okay, we are here. Switching around with the glasses until I can go. I'm probably going to try and go today and get some new ones since they're more comfortable for driving. But they're not good for close up because they're progressive. Meaning that I can't really see close up very well. I haven't gotten used to them and I hate that. So anyway, let's go see our babies. I have to, I have to watch Rachel get this pony. This is so funny. He's freaking out. He's, mm, it was a car. He's like looking at those ponies. Like, here, take her in. Here, I'll take him in. You go help her. Might have to move. Okay. Uh oh. I don't want to do we'll this. Okay. It's okay, handsome Chino. Come on. Yes. The ponies are going crazy. Come on. Hey, handsome boy. Do you know where Sparky's halter is? It's not. Hello. Hello, Newton. Okay. Hello. 
So clearly Buns does not want to be taught today. She's about to do it. She's about to do it. Uh, Avery. Come here. Come here. Come here. Here. I'd like something for you. Here, here. Just let me, you should have just let me catch her. She was coming up to me. Yeah, here. Here, here, here. Good girl, good girl, good girl. See, I caught her. It was because of me, Laura the Pony Wrangler. Uh, yes, it was all because of me. the two ponies. Because I wrangled them all. She clearly does not want to go. Six months. Yeah, you got caught. Yeah, I know. I love cricket. She's the good one in that field. Yeah, she's the good pony in that field. All right, Gabby, get tacked up, my love. All right, so we are at the barn early today for lessons because um, it's family day, and so our coach can spend time with her family tonight if we get lessons done in the daytime. And it's better in the daytime because it's not as cold. Begin building up those, you be building up those muscles, Chino. So Gabby's riding Chino more in lessons and Finn less. Before she used to ride Finn more, but um, she has a show this weekend, so she is gonna make sure. She's gonna work with him. Cause Sparky smokes like this. Yeah, probably. Rachel's mom made us these soaps for Valentine's Day and she just gave them to us. This one's called Sea... Sea Salt Mermaid. Sea Salt Mermaid. It smells so good, you guys. And what was mine? Uh, orange lemon essential oil and mojito orange lemon and mojito so she's gonna give me some mojito anyway she makes amazing bath stuff and she has a youtube channel <laughs> how crazy <laughs> uh anyways i'll just say anyways it, they are amazing like i love all the stuff that you give us what is your channel just in case somebody it's, wants to it's bubble and squeak diy be bubble and squeak diy and you teach people how to do this right yes yeah i yeah. should go there you should come <laughs> and teach me it's so cool we'll have to do a day sometime yeah we'll have to do a day sometime I see it in your eyes Yeah, I can read the signs You need to get away It's time we make a change Oh, you know you'll always have me Baby, I will always stay with you So put your trust in We'll work it out, you'll see If we get in a car and drive someplace far Yeah, we could go for a ride The two of us, we don't have to stop Baby, let's go for a ride You and I, let us run away We can go where we want I'll have you I think that if she ever mastered the harder th things on Finn, that they would be... This is really nice. I know, this is beautiful. Like, this is show winning. Maybe she wants to show him in hack. But he I won't know. do as good Ooh. in hack, right? She would fall. No, it's the cannery. Oh, yeah. In a group. Mm -hmm. In a group of 15 horses. He's happy though. Look at how happy he looks. You are riding that nice big truck so beautifully, Sophia. I'm proud of her for stepping out of her comfort zone and being. Well, she was the, her saddle's coming any day, and so she's like, um, what I I'm riding it first. It's my saddle. I'm having the first ride. Good girl.
just living off the edge Only good times ahead So let me put a smile upon your face You love them? You're lucky to have a horse like him. All right, you guys, Sam is home. <laughs> it's cold. Oh, we are headed out for supper because that's what you do on a family day. I didn't want to go out for supper because we just went out for supper on Valentine's Day. Isn't Valentine's Day family day? Like, what the heck, Canada? Why are you having all these holidays? But it is a holiday nonetheless, and this is our last time going out for a while. This is our last time going out for a while. Gabby and Sam picking up on me. We're like, let's go eat at our favorite place. Our favorite place, I'm gonna show you guys what I'm gonna get is my favorite family day meal because everybody's gonna wanna eat for my plate. It's family day, ladies. Put your phones away. I didn't even bring my phone. Gabby gives me the evil eye. That's funny, you didn't bring your phone. I didn't bring, but look at it, we got flowers. Everybody did. <laughs> Gabby got her traditional wings, she ordered 12. It looks like it's 50. Count them. Oh look, I got extra carrots. Like Save them for the horses. Gabby, Sophie got chicken nuggets. Why didn't you order chicken fingers? She got chicken nuggets. Yeah, chicken fingers. yeah that's the chicken well, fingers here. Well, you order for her show. That's what she gets. <laughs> uh, Sam got fish and chips, which I want a piece of. And I am going diet. No, just joking. Mine's not here yet. This is what I got. It's, it's nachos. It's Greek nachos. And they're so good. Yeah. They're handmade nachos with tzatziki sauce. So good. That is it for today's video, you guys. We are done at the restaurant. We are headed home to do editing. Girls are going to get ready for bed. And I just wanted to remind you guys, family is not who you're born into, it is who you love. And I've believed that my whole entire life and I taught my boys that and I think it's important to say it again, but family is not who you, always who you're born to, it's who you love. Family can be made up of anything, just like you guys are our day fam. It's important to spend time with the people that care about you and that you care about. See you guys tomorrow.